Hello friends and hello students. In this session, we learn the friend function in C++. So here I share my laptop screen and here fix the position so you can watch better way my video lecture. And here Turbo C++, I just double click and take some time, just some process and now open. Alter F file menu and take a new file. And here our goal, friend, that is keyword and friend function. Here I cover the fourth type because in my previous three video lecture I covered the one class uh, and one friend function that is a first type. Second type is a one friend function and two class and now a third type is a one specific member uh, data member function is a friend of other class. So here fourth type one class uh, is friend of other class one class is friend of other class that is four types so there are four type of friend function we have to define so one class one friend function two class and one friend function one specific member or specified data member function is a friend of other class so in first type all three type there is two class okay and here, uh, all one class is a friend. Here, you can also say that uh, one uh, one class friend of other class, or one all all is all that member that access that type of. So that all one all member of function a friend of other class. That also you can write that type of name in this type. So what is a meaning? That is a here one class is friend of other class. So that first class is friend of that second class. You can say that. So that uh, uh, first class, uh, all member access by the second class. That is a meaning. So that is a that private member all that is not a member of that class. After, uh, after that, that is access that class of friend, uh, that private member. So let us we give example then and you can understand better what is this concept. So first we can uh, start our include file that is a header section or link our uh, header file. So uh, io stream dot h input output stream and then on your console input output dot h and then class declaration and that is first class and we can define here as a like uh, two private member x and y so i uh, here i give the two tab because there it here write the private keyword by default class scope is a private and then public and we can define the public and then colon sign that is uh, visibility mode private public and protect protect we can see in the inheritance that time we have to cover so here you can first Set value. You can also use the constructor, but I not cover the constructor, so I use the set value or set value. So here integer a and here integer b. Okay. So you can constructor is a better, but here we can not I cover constructors in my video lecture, so I use the set value. And here x equal to a and then y equal to b. So that is set set value and also take one show and we can just print our x and y value so here i tab and then the x and y values are okay so first print x x here and then one blank and then print y and then end l end l is a manipulator taking new line and now turn to friend yes that friend keyword or friend we can say that friend and then class keyword yes that is a syntax friend keyword class keyword and then class name of second so you can give any name like here i cover the first and second give that class name you can use any simple test one two that type of all like a feet each meter distance that also take in that member here i just to first cover the concept one class is a friend of other class what is that then after I uh, complete a feet each uh, uh, distance that is meter centimeter over minutes that type of member we can also sum okay sum that formula 
okay now in uh, that is a we can define in that two member is a inside that is inline function by default because that is a only one or two lines there so that's not right inline keyword and now turn to second class so here is second class is start and stem column that is a second class is there come to picture and that uh, we can take as a thread as a member and then public part we can take so here uh, we can use the uh, not uh, that we can set but directly that uh, sum so what sum so here we can take the second first class object and taking x y sum in z so that is possible because uh, second class is a friend of uh, first class so all private member access by the show sum or any that all members that access so here i define two member like show again here and also pass the first class object then and then that member is access so you know in a friend function so here all second class member uh, is accessed by the x y value because that is a all class is a friend of other class that all member access the second class is a first x y so that is a possible so let us how it's possible so that we cannot uh, set z we can here outside definition so void and then second class name that scope resolution operator and sum and then we can pass the first and temp value so any given tm temp and here we can sum z equal to uh, temp dot x plus temp dot y yes that finish so only one line and now we can take like uh, second yes outside of class and then show yes that is a also show the second class member and here we can print first uh, that object is remaining first class and here also i give temp no any error so we can print again the x and y value so here i use the second yes so you can understand that is print by second class so here second class that is print the private member x y value of first class so x and then y so there are two time x and y value print okay and then i print the sum that is a z value and also that is a x and y that's that summation is or also you can say that the a z value so i here give the z as a value sum in taking the z value okay so sum is and here sum is and the z value is both is same so here i paint the z yes so that is very simple and now let turn to main our function last in the bottom to top that is a c++ object oriented programming so first i can save this file so yes friend and um, we can say that uh, function type 4 or we can say type that type 4 so that uh, cpp that default so yes now and also friend class cls that type of give the name file and here first i declare the like a and b and pass the value so clear the string yes <clears throat> and here i scan from user so a b value we can pass in the first class initialized to x and y so enter a and b uh, value yes and we, here we can say that that value is a first class so here just for reference first class yes so just first class a b it means that value is taking from set value a and that is b so just in your mind so here you can first f1 and f1 that set value you can pass a and b yes and then we can show first that member also show if you not define show in first class there is no any required because we can also print in the second class show x y so i just prove that uh, all member access in second class that private member that is my goal so here now first class is complete now we can come to second class object and that is we can sum 
call and that passed F1, that object of first class, and then show and also that passed the first class object. And yes, all are 12, forget CH, and then come to this. Uh, I think there is no any required. Yes, so first I save, yes, and yes, any, yes, here we can, the syntax I declare. So what is a syntax? So that is first a friend, keyword, yes, then we can say that class name, that is finish, so and semicolon, yes, so that is a friend is a keyword, class is a keyword and class name second so just all that is meaning that second class is a friend of first class and that all uh, member of second class access the x y value so here the sum of second class access the x y value and show of second class that is also x y value and also z that is sum of that x y value not uh, z we cannot initialize any value that is a sum on x y value that is a member of private of first class, but that uh, the sum in the second class private variable. So that is possible. So that is a friend, that is a back um, the security because that is a private member access. So that is a oops principle. We can up to till to now say that uh, that class member only public member access the private member, but that is a not all sum and show that is not member of first class. That is a second class. Here is show also, but uh, that is a different that show, and here is second show, second class show. So that is all two sum, and also you can define third. I just print directly here sum you can define, and then some other very uh, function you can also define and print that said value also possible. But here I take only two member of second class. So yes, let us take any error. I cannot compile this file. So there is some possibility sometime not giving the error because here we can use the class second, but second class is a declaration here. So we can use to directly here. So that is forward declaration sometime is required. Yes, so that is a yes here. So yes, here first uh, that object name is required. Yes, stem dot not directly we have to print. So in the first you can see here that uh, show of this that is a that public member that print directly x y value that is a first class okay but here we can use the second class uh, show and that print the private member so object is a function argument in the friend function i revise the all rules of friend function friend function is a must be passed as a object of that class so here we can pass the first class object that is must be object as a function argument and we can declare the inside class here we can declare the fan keyword is inside the first class but after all the that is a not a member of that class we can say that the second class is the other and first class is the other so two distinct class two separate class so and uh, that is a we can say that normal function definition and calling but here is a member so we can define the membership but here not uh, taking the friend keyword in that uh, definition okay so that is all member of second class is a friend of first class so that is you can so here z is not require any object because z is a itself that uh, second class member so here that is a here that okay so there is two error but now it's solved yes there is no any error so i can say in previously here we can declare as a second class, but sometimes that not give here. We can define after that, but we can use in before here, not a second class come to into picture and we can use that class name. So friend class second. So here already declare. So that not giving the here, here like class and second. So that is not taking any error. Okay. So here that is a forward declaration is not required because we can already declare type syntax that is a syntax cover that class name. So that is not giving any error. But in my previous uh, video lecture in two class and one function, we can declare the forward declaration. That is a compiler say that that class in after that come to the picture in that uh, uh, body. Okay. So here that not require forward declaration because we can already forward declaration look like that syntax. So only friend keyword and forward declaration. So here what we can do in forward declaration here we can declare like class and second and semicolon 
so that is known as a forward declaration but here not required that not taking any error because that is a same syntax in friend class one class is friend of other class so here i just remove that not require this statement okay so here now all er error are solved and let us i just compile yes there is no error and run yes first uh, first class a b means we can pass the set value so i give nine and like six so 15 is answer yes some that first print nine and six and then second class that print the second class x y value that is a uh, print by the that uh, show method so x y value print by the first class show that itself member and second class show that is a print x y value so that is a possibility and now the sum is come the sum and z value is both are same so we can say that 15 yes that is a answer is 15 so we cannot taking the z value because z value is a x y sum so x plus y value is a 9 and 6 so that is a 15 answer so we can print two times x y value by using the first class show method and second class show method that is a friend of first class so all member of second class use the first class x y value we can say that prove this yes here we can prove so here second class sum is used x y value and here show that is a not member of first class but after all that is access the x y value okay and also we can say that is a directly we can use that is a member of second class there is no any require object name because that is itself member we can say that z but we can sum of x y value that is a very important point to this definition so one class is a friend of other class so after this session you can here take the feet and each member uh, meter and centimeter and then you can uh, like uh, also over and minutes or yes so you can take that formula okay so that is also possible but here i not cover because that is i just goal what is a friend class of one class friend of other class that is my goal of this session so we can first learn that syntax and then after we can take some uh, different definition like uh, fit each uh, distant class we can take that is a meter and centimeter and over and minute that type of some formula we have to but here i just uh, two integer sum that is the definition only we can say that one class friend of other class uh, write a program to uh, sum of two class in instant variable or the class member using the one class friend of other class that type of definition of this session so i think you can understand enjoy this session what is a friend function and one class is friend of other class that is we can define i just revise the summary so write this program to not xy that is first class public set a b assign show xy print and then come to picture friend class name that friend class second so all uh, friend that is uh, used by that uh, second class yes and we can also uh, access its uh, show uh, sum and show uh, or you can say that this uh, set value and show because that is a whole class is a friend of second class okay so here we can testing yes uh, i just uh, but uh, set value is a demanding value so here we can take the object yes uh, also possibility yes uh, let us check how it's possible so here we can after yes very important point so here we can sum pass the first class object and here we can pass the second uh, first class object in sum and show both okay so i think that is complete and i cover uh, important point in that uh, in next session so that is long session is there so yes that right program to your not complete here and close this uh, file and my session complete write this program to your not i just uh, simple way to go so you can write easy way so here our first class yes uh, x y public set value a b assign show and x y print and friend class that is very important and second class uh, and if that is used to know terminate the semicolon first class and second class 
that is said and public sum and show both are pass the first class object or that argument object as function argument of the class right and here z tem dot x tem dot y sum private variable x y of first class and show is print x y and then z we have to print that sum and main ab and scan yet that is very easy set we can call the first class ab and assign then show also second class sum pass f1 and show also f1 and get ch okay that finish so i close this file yes and that uh, also close message and quit so subscribe my channel ashok sijal academy press the bell icon to never miss any update thanks for your watching supporting and sharing my video lecture or any doubt for any this definition or any definition of c++ or any language you can write in comment section i definitely give the answer okay and just thanks and hare krishna